Hello everyone, today we are going to solve a problem that our mouse input goes to our UI. As you can see here, is my current scene. If I press any object, it gives me object selected, and if I press button, it gives me button clicked. But if I press here, you can see our object is selected and button is clicked at the same time. But we don't want that. So there are two main ways you can solve this problem. Let me show you the easiest one. So you're going to create a method is mouse over UI into event system dot current is pointer over game object. You're going to return here. Also make I bigger now. Whenever we are clicking, we are going to check is mouse over UI. If it's true, then we are going to return. So let's see if it works. If I play and click here, so you can see only button is clicked, not the object. So our problem is solved. And this is the easiest way to solve it. But there is another one and i wanted to show you guys that one too that because maybe there is some cases you want that i don't know your <laughs> use cases so let's get another method private bull is mouse pointer over ui we're going to now pointer event data we're going to pass event system dot current then we are going to set the position to recast new list this result now event system dot current Recast all. We're going to pass event data and recast hits and return if recast results dot count in zero. Means if it hit at least one. Okay. So let's check if it works. If is mouse pointer over ui return comment out the previous code let's see if it works yep it's working so, yep. so both ways works um, you should use any of them based on your requirement let's consider another image here you can see if I press our object let me show you our object is not selected that because uh, we need to change the recast result if we do that here so our input goes to UI but you can achieve the similar result here by comparing your hits count okay so I hope this helps and thank you guys for watching